what is happening guys Martin Martin is back again thank you for the likes and comments and subscriptions keep them coming it's much appreciated um life is changing guys so again i'll keep my best to keep up with the channel i do enjoy um comments guys so by all means i'll make sure that i get these videos to you so here's my quick review of nautica voyage now a lot of people have said this is a classic this is a cheap this is one that you need to have i've had this bottle now for probably about maybe three years you can see how much juice i've used in this one now for me guys this isn't nowhere near one of my favorites at all. Um, I'll probably spray this probably before maybe going to bed or just coming out of the shower and just put on a little bit then. But as you can see, this is the um, result of three years worth of fragrances compared to my other fragrances. It is a cheapie. Um, at the time, I think I bought this on Amazon when I um, was starting to get into fragrances and it is a cheap fragrance. Um, I believe now you can get it probably for about even 10 to 20 pounds in the UK and um, probably even cheaper some places, you never know. Um, if it's on sale maybe but for what it is guys 100 mil um this one um for what i can see guys the cap is a bit cheap if the cap is like a plastic cap you can see on the inside um but for what you're paying guys i won't expect too much but it's a cheap cap and um, but it's sturdy the spray is not too bad okay now for me um i'm gonna give you the note breakdown and i'll give you my thoughts so the note breakdown according to fragratica um, is based on green leaves um, apple seeing that we got some uh, amber in there some musk in the base um, with a bit of cedar wood and some lotus um, and there's another flowery note in there for me guys I get like a, a marine type of smell but the prominent note the most prominent note for this one which I just don't particularly like is cucumber now it doesn't say that on Fragratica to be the main note but for me that's what I'm smelling so for me guys it doesn't really i'm not a fan of cucumbers i don't like the taste of it and i don't like the smell of it and for me guys i smell cucumber on this one now it is a fresh scent don't get me wrong and it does work for many people the longevity in this one easily easily getting about two to three hours um it's not even a problem where you need to really reapply because in the heat this one will project um, and this one will give you um value for money now for what this is guys um, it's for those that like those type of marine smells, but like that sort of fresh crisp smell That's what it smells like to me and um, it's not a bad one by by any means So don't get me wrong just my personal preferences I just don't like the smell of the cucumber that I get from it and that's the most prominent note for me Maybe with a bit of the apple green apple um, and the notes that seem to be coming out, but as it stands guys um, Value for money definitely there and um, where to wear this one obviously in the summertime in that heat um, but for me guys it's just not I'm just not a fan of the prominent cucumber smell it just doesn't work for me on my nose and my skin I'm just not a fan of that but that's ultimately my review on it guys if you've not tried this one out definitely try it out it's not a bad purchase but it's just not one for me okay and before I finish just want to say also somebody mentioned about um, looking on Amazon to buy fragrances guys um, again my particular point of saying that is at the time when I purchased it that fragrance was um, Versace Eros. Um, again, I paid 50 pounds, got 200 mil. At the time, I didn't see that to be a bad deal at the time. So it's not necessarily saying go to Amazon as your first choice to, f to find fragrances. What I'm saying is at the time I purchased that particular fragrance, okay? So don't sweat it, guys. There's loads of things out there you can look to to buy fragrances, fragrance net, and all these other things online. That's entirely up to yourself where you want to go. But for me, guys, I like to do my research and I try and see what the best deal is at the time. And that's where I went with at the time for the 50, for 200 mil for 50 pounds of Versace Eros. Okay, guys. So thank you very much for likes and subscriptions. That's my review of the uh, Nautica Voyage. Um, again, it's one that you may want to check out, guys. But I'll see you soon.